Hey everybody, Shelma32 here. Welcome to the channel. We're here today to react to the Red Dwarf Season 1 Mega. I hadn't planned on reacting to this, but then something arrived today that uh, I forgot I'd ordered. And, um... <laughs> I got the Blu-ray set. Seasons 1 through 8. So, it's going to be fun. Now, it's a Blu-ray set, but all the extras are on DVD. So I can watch the extras straight off of there, because otherwise I wouldn't be able to do that, because I'd have to go through, take all the stuff off, and ah. But, yeah. The short little bits of Megups per season. I've, I can remember one of them. I mentioned it in the episode, the Mr. Lister Sir type one. But, yeah. Megups are one of the best things about Red Dwarf. I freaking love them. I love bloopers from anything, really. So, Red Dwarf one and stuff like they made like they used to release like VHSs and DVDs of just the smeg ups like collections of smeg ups I freaking love them like I can see ones in my head I don't know what episodes they're from I remember the smeg ups and I fucking love it and I'm in a good mood today I'm tired but I'm going to be sitting up late again to catch up on Good Omen season 2 and then yeah but we had some good news today stuff got a date for turning over the keys or receiving the keys so good news good mood gonna make it even better to watch some smegats but if you enjoy the reaction don't forget to like comment subscribe give the notification bell a tick you'll know when the next episode goes live let's get going with the reaction in three two one let's go Watch Smeg Ups in years. I'm so excited. This is an SOS distress call from one. the mining ship Sweet. Red Dwarf. The crew are dead, killed by a radiation leak. The only survivors uh -huh. were Dave Lister, who was in suspended animation during the disaster, and his pregnant cat, who was safely sealed in the hold. Revived three Come million on. years later, Lister's only oh. companions are a life form. I didn't know we had Holly Smeg. <laughs> 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 Smeg Ups. This is awesome. Sorry, I, I'm not usually rude. He's a holly, he's on his hand. Sinclair, you... Oh, <laughs> Not usually <laughs> rude. <laughs> Perhaps the most... <laughs> <laughs> Mr, is that a cigarette? I, I forgot about the holly ones. It's going to wrench my heart from its sockets to do so, Lister. But I've forgotten my notebook, so I can't... <laughs> <laughs> As it was happening, I kind of saw it coming. <laughs> oh, <come> on, <laughs> I love these, I love them. Oh, you just knew it was with the cat, with Frankenstein, you knew that it was going to be some kind of issues. How many takes did this take? Oh. My headphone fell out there. What's that? <laughs> My headphone fell out. Fuck. Luckily it didn't pause it, so all right. He broke it. Oh, he broke it. <laughs> <laughs> How am I looking? How am I looking? <laughs> I got his game? Oh, right. <laughs> he changed his oh, accent, that's so cool. Oh no, he's on fire. Shit. How did you do? Yeah, this is the one I remembered. This is the How bit I remembered. This, How did I do, Mr. Lister, sir? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look at you, Lister. Where's your I love the, uh... Where's your colouring pencils? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I believe in aliens, Lister. Oh, right, fine. Something sensible at last. <laughs> aliens, Lister, with technology so far in advance of our own, we can't even begin to imagine. I mean, that's, 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 <laughs> Supple this guy was slobby, fantastic. Slobby, 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 slobbiness, slobbiness, for God's sake. He was yeah. so good. Slobbiness. All these years I kept the faith. I wore the holy custard stain and the, and the sacred gravy mark. I renounced coolness and chose the righteous path of stubbles. <laughs> you fucked it up again. Look, I've been thinking. <laughs> No, I haven't. No, I haven't. 
Oh, I fucking love them. Ready? Stand by. She loves me. Listen, <laughs> it's gonna rip my heart from its socket to do this, but I'm gonna have to report you twice in as many minutes. Ten. He didn't have much luck in that corridor, did he? <laughs> oh, that was it! It ended so suddenly. I'm exiting the Blu-ray or the, the disc, which has made my go a bit orange, but I had to because it goes back. It went back to the menu so suddenly. That that changed. So suddenly, oh, I fucking love Smaggots. I I think this would be a cool thing to do at the end of every season, is react to the Smaggots because it's fun. I love bloopers. I love Smaggots, as I said. This was a really cool like menu, computer generated as well. I, for the special bits menu, it went that into the room, and then there's a fucking toaster, and you're Holly on the screen. Saying stuff, repeating his lines, and you got the toaster fucking talking like, "Hey, you've seen my reactions to the series. I hate that fucking toaster." Oh, I love this smegups. Like, you just like if you're ever feeling down, just put on Red Dwarf smegups. It makes you laugh. They're so funny. Like, they're just so funny. I love them. And it was that Danny John Jules one. He was like going up. Oh, oh right. But then that little bit where he just slips out of the cat's accent because he sounds so different then in that one moment. And he's just, just the way Chris Barry just looks at the camera like, oh dear, I fucked up. <laughs> and seeing Holly raise his hand. It's just weird. But ah. Oh, I wish also on these that they had them all clump, clumped together, you know. So I could watch all of the seasons once put together, but not. I'm looking forward to it. With the seasons, if I want to react to the stuff on the Blu-ray, I've got to take because my laptop doesn't... You can't capture from... Maybe with this, it doesn't do it on my uh, Doctor Who ones, but you never know, this one might be different. It will not record and take from the disc, so I'd have to like cut them off, yada, yada, yada. But... We'll see. Apparently some of the remasters are better than others. We'll see. Yeah. I fucking love Smagups. You can't not love Smagups. Their bloopers are always fun. And it reminds you, they're just human. They're just humans like us. They make mistakes. They get annoyed at their mistakes. It, it just, it makes me enjoy the shows and the films I watch more when they release bloopers. It makes me appreciate their talent more, you know, their dedication. But, ah, uh, I just like with the bit with the notepad, I was like, and like the pen, like I could just see the pen bit coming and the, no, I don't. It's like it, like the split second before, like it came into my head. I was like, I don't know if that's because like, now I remember watching it before, but I don't know if in that moment it was me remembering or, or just guessing what he was going to say. I think this would be a nice thing to do. A nice little short video. Watch the smug up at the end of every season. I think that'd be a nice, fun thing to do. And I, again, I love, I love it. I love Red Dwarf. I say, I've said every video. It makes me happy. Can't describe how it makes me feel, but I love it. But um, if you if you would would like the, my brain's trying to say several things at once, and it all just got caught up on. Bleh. If you think you'd like to see me react to the smeg ups at the end of every season like this, let me know and we can get going with that every season. Um, I hope you enjoyed the reaction. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Give the notification bell a tick. You'll know when the next episode goes live. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you again for the next one. Bye.